A village of mice must defend themselves against an invading toad army in a story that weds Watership Down with the Norse pro Zeta. You are the champion Mycel, the finest warrior in a clan that has long enjoyed peace under the grace of Freya. But when the runestone that shelters the village mysteriously loses its power, Mycel must take up arms to save his people from the cruelty of the sorcerer Toadon. Mysgard is a top-down action game with some tactical elements. Mycel is not alone in his quest. He leads a small force of warriors who are under his indirect control. The player can switch between three formations, an offensive wedge in which the rear flanks fire bows to harass distant targets, a defensive formation in which all the warriors gather in a circle to block attacks from all angles, and a free movement order in which all the warriors pick their own targets at will. The player will need to regularly change between formations in order to adapt to the circumstances of the fight. There are some light RPG elements in Mysgard, with Mycel collecting resources used to repair the damage caused to the village. This is narrative as much as mechanical, Mycel and his warriors do get some bonuses from fixing buildings, but those bonuses aren't necessary or sufficient to complete the campaign. There's a bit of variety in the levels. Most task the player with reaching some goal, but others call for seeking out specific items or protecting an NPC. There are even levels that mix things up by having the player take charge of a ballista for a defensive minigame or captain a longship for a horizontal shoot 'em up level. Mysgard is a short, easy game that most people will be able to finish in about two hours or less. While there are a few minor branch points, there probably isn't enough to merit a second playthrough.